Hey guys, it's Eddie the Magic Monk. Today I want to talk about the easiest way to turn a PowerPoint presentation into a video, into an MP4 file. So right now I have a PowerPoint and uh, usually you would click through a PowerPoint. So let's say I'm in presentation mode now and I click through it. All right, so this is what the PowerPoint looks like. And you might write a few things on the screen using the uh, pen tool and things like that. Okay, but it's not a video. So I want to turn all that into a video. So what do you do? Well, you would go to slideshow and then you can see an option called record slideshow. Okay, now if you've already clicked on this before by accident, you will have some timings here already, in which case you would clear them. But uh, because I haven't clicked on this yet, so I don't have anything to clear. So you would click cl record from beginning because that's what you want to do to start recording the presentation uh, into a video from the start. So click this. Okay, and then you are going to click record. So click start the recording. All right, it's going to give you a few seconds. And then it started. So now I can talk, I can click through the video. So in today's presentation, we're going to talk about blah, blah, blah. And you can see this is a really cool picture. Let's keep clicking through. And this is the second slide. And here's a timeline for something that I'm talking about. And we can keep clicking through. We can write some stuff on the screen. So I'm going to use a orange pen, write some stuff on the screen while I'm going through the presentation and I can turn the pen tool off and keep clicking to finish the video. Click to exit. Okay, so now I have just turned this presentation into a video. So to see what the video looks like, you need to click the first slide and then click the slideshow button. And then it started. So now I can talk, I can click through the video. Okay, so now what we're going to do is turn this video into a movie file. Okay, so to do that, you would go to File, uh, Save As, and then go to um, this PC, and then you're going to save it on your desktop, and you can simply choose uh, some sort of... Um, movie file so dot mp4 is good and give it a name so i'm just going to keep it as title lorem and just click save okay and click yes so this will now go onto your desktop and you can see here that it's going to take a little bit to convert it okay so let it convert Okay, so it's finished converting, so I'm now going to try and find it on my desktop. Okay, so let's see if I can find it on my desktop. So here is my desktop. Okay, and you can see the video, so I'm going to double click on that. And then it started, so now I can talk, I can click through the video. So in today's presentation, we're going to talk about blah, blah, blah. And you can see this is a really cool picture. Let's keep clicking through. And this is the second slide. And here's a timeline for something that I'm talking about. And we can keep clicking through. We can write some stuff on the screen. So that's the video. Now, the only downside to this that I can think of is when you are switching between slides, it's better if you don't talk. Okay, so you can see here, when I'm switching from one slide to the next, you can hear a bit of a sound um, volume change. So from here, listen to the volume. Blah, 
blah blah and you can see this is a really cool picture let's keep clicking through and okay so there was a bit of a volume change when you uh, swapped over from one slide to another so when you were swapping slides try to not talk and let it swap and then you talk again after the next slide is on the screen all right thanks for watching guys see you next time Thanks for watching guys, see you next time.